Um, recently got out of the business world, the concrete business, in uh, the fall of 2014, where I worked for ReadyMix Concrete, which is a ULIS uh, company. U.S. Concrete is their corporate company who offices here out of ULIS as well. And uh, they've been in support of uh, a lot that Six Stones has done by providing materials or providing food or what have you for uh, these CPR events. And that's really where I heard about Six Stones and CPR. I don't have a construction background other than selling a concrete. And so I don't know, you know, I don't know what soffit is. I, I don't, you know, I know what a gutter looks like. So I've learned a lot in the last five years serving at Six Stones for sure. Um, but thankfully, we've, they've got a great team. CPR's got a great team of, of guys that are very skilled at what they do, uh, as well as when you bring on uh, lay to leadership or when you bring on um, uh, community people to be involved. Boy, they've got a lot of knowledge and they can really, really help support the cause. Businesses and churches and community people and, and school districts and community government, city governments coming together as a whole to serve uh, uh, their community. Um, and, and it really takes all of them to do it uh, from whether it's a Home Depot and Lowe's that are supplying materials for these CPR events or whether it's uh, you know different businesses supporting um, uh, the back to school event where they we bring in, uh, they give money for all the backpacks and all the school supplies that are needed to supply these thousands of kids with backpacks before school starts. Whether it's a business that, that says, hey, you know what, we want to be community centered. We want to reach, to give back to our community. We want to do team building um, exercises where we can go together and take a house and do a house at CPR together and really create some unity and, and some collaboration within the team. There's so many different opportunities that each one of those entities can have as they come together uh, the, uh, to volunteer to serve their community. And not just community focus, but it's also rewarding to the people that are serving uh, internally as individuals and together as a group uh, in each of those different organizations. We all have times in our life where there is significant need, whatever that looks like. It could be my house is broken down and you know what, I'm disabled or I have become disabled or you lose your job and you have kids. Man, that makes life pretty difficult and so we can all within you know a matter of a week fall into the same circumstances of life that the people that we're serving um, are in. You know, they meet people where they are in life. It's the same way uh, with their counseling services. It's the same way um, through the interpersonal relationships that we're cultivating within each event. To be able to make a big impact in our community, we've got to have a lot of people on the same page, moving in the same direction in support of the people that are in need. There's a lot of needs and I don't know of any other organization out there you know, that I've ever seen or been involved in that do intentionally what Six Stones does. Everything that they do is try to make the city a better place to live. Everything that they do is to try to, to bless people um, by the work of their hands in a gospel-centered, Christ-centered uh, movement.